Consumers are now expecting companies to care about their environmental impact and bring more sustainable practices into their business initiatives. But alongside this trend, retailers have seen another shift, a rise in e-commerce accelerated by the global pandemic. Improving e-commerce is all about providing seamless experiences for customers. But how does sustainability come into play? Today, we're going to explore how retailers are applying artificial intelligence to not only improve operations, but to pave the way for a more sustainable future. First, let's look at demand planning. During the peak of COVID-19 lockdowns, demand planning became critical for retailers to meet customer needs, balancing high demand with limited supply. But what happens when there's just too much product? Simple, it goes to waste. And for food retailers, that waste adds up fast. Retailers created an estimated 10.5 tons of food waste in 2019. 35% of that went directly to the landfill. Artificial intelligence can reduce surplus ordering by analyzing data like store traffic, perishability, shopping patterns, weather, and other historical trends, allowing retailers to more accurately predict or forecast shifts in demand and how it translates to factors like shelf life and availability. This cuts down on excess product that not only reduces food waste, but costs associated with lost potential revenue from unsold goods. Then there's route optimization. Route optimization goes beyond figuring out the best way to get from point A to point B. It's a way to make deliveries more efficient, reduce last mile costs, and curb fuel emissions. According to the EPA, medium and heavy duty trucks are the second largest source of greenhouse gas emissions behind light duty vehicles like passenger cars. And with continued growth of e-commerce spiking delivery demand, the need for fast, convenient experiences is paramount. Some retailers are using artificial intelligence to chart that path to better delivery. AI can analyze data from across the organization to offer a more consolidated view of order management, helping retailers effectively route orders to the right places at the right times. The United States Postal Service, for example, has been leveraging route optimization as part of their sustainability plan for years. By 2016, AI had helped the organization make 55,000 routes more efficient, saving nearly 10 million gallons of fuel annually and reducing 100,000 metric tons of carbon emissions. Then there's greener delivery altogether. Outside of just route optimization, some organizations are looking to ditch gas powered vehicles, exploring alternative delivery methods that are just a little bit greener. In March, 2021, for example, FedEx announced an ambitious plan to go carbon neutral by 2040, a plan powered largely by a commitment to converting their fleet to electric vehicles. Other companies are taken to the skies. Retailers like Amazon, Walmart, and more recently Kroger are piloting drone delivery with goals to cut down on delivery times while keeping the roads just a bit more clear. And then there's autonomous vehicles. Brands like Postmates and Domino's are exploring whether these electric powered options can help deliver things like pizza or groceries. And finally, there's working with consumers. Increases in e-commerce delivery simply means more boxes and ultimately more of those materials that end up in the trash or even worse, our environment. The e-commerce packaging market is expected to produce more than 4 billion pounds of plastics by 2025. And one route retailers can take to curb this excess packaging is by implementing something called smart order consolidation, or the practice of bundling products from different brands into one large shipment. For consumers, this helps make last mile delivery faster and more convenient. They get all their products at once. It also allows all those individual orders to be packaged at the same time, ultimately reducing waste too. However, Order consolidation can also slow down delivery times, which impacts customer experience. But researchers at MIT discovered that consumers are willing to wait if they know their deliveries will be more environmentally friendly. In fact, their study with one retailer in Mexico found that consumers were willing to wait up to five days for their deliveries after learning and getting educated a little bit more about their environmental impact. At the end of the day, there is no end all solution to solving our world's sustainability issues. It is a collaborative effort, but consumers are paying attention and technology is helping retailers to make strides towards a greener future while also making e-commerce better for shoppers in the long run. 
And these examples today aren't the only ways brands are doing it. For more on this topic, check out our Life is Dataful episode on the circular economy. And that's all for me. Thank you for tuning in to another episode of Life is Dataful. See you next time. Thank you.